Didn't we all come here with an agenda? The forgotten hall door, not enough for you? I don't know if that's good storytelling. There's one thing about me. I will point out the loopholes in your story. Let's end the filler episode here. I got Akron and Black Swan in the same room now. We are so back. <laughs> Hello, friends and gamers. We're playing Star Rail again. I just finished recording another Star Rail video, but I'm kind of like really into it. And it is a Saturday night. Technically now it's Sunday at midnight. Um, but my sleep schedule has been so bad lately because I haven't been feeling well. And so I just really want to play Star Rail. <laughs> we're still on Pentacony, we're, but we're in the reverie now. We're in reality, back to reality. Should one awaken at midnight? We are assembling with the crew after we got stuck in a nightmare dreamscape. At the critical moment, though, a memo keeper named Black Swan pulls you back to reality. She knows that you are in a rush, but hopes that you will calm down first and reassure your companions that you are safe. They have been waiting all this time for you to wake from your coma. We were in a literal coma. Although you can't help but wonder, why does every visitor in Panacone look so strange? Okay, now I'm scared. I'm scared about that. That's just what we're getting into today. I thought we were done with the spooks, but I don't think we're done with spooks. As we learned in the last video, Panacone is now operating on JRPG rules, wherein we must in interact with everything. So investigate. Just something about thermostats. Okay. It's actually kind of cool, though, that they deal with the thermostat, though. Okay, that it can It's all flames, but it can either emit heat or absorb it. That's kind of cool. Because then you always have the vibe of being able to see the the things. The uh, there's a little fire. You always get to see the fire. Oh, chest. Should I ask for more? Oh, so you're having trouble sleeping. You look like you're crying. Be nice to the hotel workers. They have a hard job. These ones look okay. What's going on? What's going on? Which ones? Uh, assemble with the crew. Oh, March. March. I've got a funny oh, that's where they are. Okay. Hi, guys. <laughs> oh, Black Swan. They're talking about Black Swan. Hi, guys. Um, that memo am I interrupting something? Here with an agenda. I mean, sure. Just yeah, true. Vigilant. Doesn't everyone in Pentacone come here? Didn't we all come here with an agenda? We came here with an agenda. The, we got the weird letter. We came here with an agenda. Anyways, hi, guys. <laughs> Look, Akron and Well. I brought the kid back. As the, the kid. <laughs> okay, so that's how she got in our room, cause we we, could we couldn't. In either dream yeah. We were worried cause that. our text didn't go through. Okay, so it's they got Black Swan to, to help. Or did Black Swan come to them? Me to introduce you I don't know. Miss Black Swan, memo keeper of the Garden. Do they know that we got a we got one of the portal things on the sh the the train, the express? Does. Anyways, um, you know each other? <laughs> yeah. Miss Himiko said that they were investigating the incidents happening in the dreamscape. They were Oh. So Himiko and Black Swan use this opportunity to get to know each other. Were okay. So Himiko and Black Swan were in the same dreamscape. Okay. So Himiko just went straight to work. All right. Good to know. So how did you end up there? How did you, I don't what sparkle? But also, we don't really know it was Sparkle, though, because we were, like, knocked out. We just think it was simple. So we can elaborate. So, the one a girl dressed in red. Okay, no, they, we do know. A girl dressed in red. Able to shapeshift. At illusory arts. Do they know? Because the masked fools were also invited. Her name is Sparkle. There we go. The masked fool who was infiltrated. Inf Pinnacle. Weren't the masked fools invited, though? She won't be bothering you for now. She's probably patting herself on the back. Either that or she's getting her bomb dolls together. Seems you know her. <laughs> for 2.3. Of course. I know everyone here. That's on Pentecone, concerning. Anyone could be lying. But the remembrance. The remembrance doesn't, doesn't lie. So I feel that should, getting rem a remembrance is going to be fun. Miss Sparkle's tricks can induce hallucinations. Yeah. But that strange dreamscape. Nothing to do nothing with her. Nothing to do with her. Okay. Oh, I'm yawning. Oh, God. Pentacony itself. Okay. Pentacony itself? Oh. Uh... Have you not sensed it yet? This apparent land of dreams. It's a carefully maintained by the family. Maintained by the family through unknown means. So do these dreams just have minds and the of their own? Zone she fell into. Okay. That's the true dreams. I'm going to say it chaotic, right now. Dangerous. Enigmatic. Because I guess, a well, if you... Of memory dwells in beast of memory. If you... Labyrinth. I guess that makes sense. That does make sense that you would have this, like, eltritch horror of a dreamscape. If that was, like, the collective dreamscape of everybody, that makes sense that it would be, like, terrifying. Like, this is where 
everyone's nightmares go to chill. Don't want to go there. A beast of memory dwells in the sh labyrinth. So that was the something unto death or whatever the heck. I think it was actually called something unto death. What was, I had another point. Oh, I think, cause there's the, the personal running theory I have, but also I, I don't know if it's entirely personal. Other people might also think this within the Hollyoverse games where uh, there'll be like one thing that is the same thing in multiple different nations, universes, what have you, but it just has a different name. So like think in Genshin how all the, the Kazami and the Abyss stuff, it's kind of the same, just has a different like name in every nation, which makes sense. But I think this could, I think the dreamscape or the memory zone, memory zones I think might just be another another name for bubble universes. I don't know, maybe something or other. I think that could work. <laughs> I think that could work. She's right. Everyone, do you all still remember your surroundings during your entry? Oh, the like the, dream the under construction? Or clocks fish in the deep sea. Oh, interesting Himiko's the one to say this line, but the deep sea. Huh. So everyone Oh yeah. I remember. So that Well, it was a room. Yep. Yep, yep, then... yep. I I cut I cut uh a room and then a uh, long hallway. So the memory zone. So memory zones are bubble universes. Yeah. That in between was kind of like the sea of quanta, but there probably is a different name for it. The deep sea. There's probably another name for it. it. I think it's it's either the same concept in a different world as Honkai Impact, or and from this point forward, if you're new here, I, I do just call Honkai Impact third Honkai uh, and Star Rail Star Rail. I don't call Star Rail Honkai. I don't care if you do. I went on a whole rant about this in the last video. I don't care if you call Star Rail Honkai. I really don't. But I personally don't. So when I say Honkai, I'm talking about Honkai Impact. Just so we're all on the same page. And I lost my point, but I think I still have a point. <laughs> Through a mirror. And it's interesting I that Himiko's then the one to kind of point that out because she would know about the Sea of Quanta. Well, too, actually. Well, maybe even more so than her because Well got stuck in there. For non-Honkai Infect third enjoyers, hi. Well did get stuck in the Sea of Quanta, I'm pretty sure at one point in time, if I'm remembering correctly. I'm pretty sure it was the Sea of Quanta. He just got stuck in there for a while. Like he's not in the beginning of Honkai Impact 3rd because he's stuck in the Sea of Quanta. He gets out. He's perfectly, we're in part two of Honkai Impact 3rd now. He's perfectly fine. He's a shut-in game developer. He is a son. The son was there before, but he's fine now, but he was stuck in the Sea of Quanta for a while. So he would know, especially because I'm pretty sure this welt kept some of his memories, but may maybe it's Sea of Quanta welt. I don't know. I think we get more into that later. <laughs> Gallery of thoughts. Gallery of thoughts. That's how the hotel staff referred to it. Gallery of thoughts then would be the Have Sea of Quanta. Noticed? Okay. These landscapes seem quite Would you like to elaborate on that? Peniconies in your dream. <laughs> would you like to elaborate on that well? Strikingly similar to the dreamscape described by Miss Black Swan. Okay. You're right. Okay. I didn't give it much thought at first, but in hindsight, the overlap is Is the overlap the Sea of Quanta, or did I miss a line? Also, after speaking to some of the frequenters, the first stop when you enter the dream is supposed, supposed to be the, to hotel, be the hotel in the dream. Oh. But due to certain incidents, okay. the hotel is now under renovation. Uh-huh. So that's what we asked Misha about before. For it to require renovation. Fair. That, with what she just experienced, and the answer is that in between is kind of going Pencon's haywire. dream is sinking right Sinking. Now. Turning back to its original form and falling into the deep sea. So this released concurrently with uh, Fontaine Genshin Impact. That's also sinking. Why? <laughs> like, I don't think there's any like lore reason for that. I'm just like, y'all did the same plot in both games at the same time. Really? <laughs> really? <laughs> okay. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. I need to drink a tea there. I'm like, okay. <laughs> you did the same baseline. Okay. I'm mad about it. I'm just like... Yeah, it's kind of funny because well, the thing with Fontaine, it's not really sinking. It's like drowning, but it's like, okay. <laughs> All right. Interesting. Sinking? Interesting there. You mean the it's collapsing. Because it's also, they talk about the water a lot. So a sign. the dreamscape hotel. Okay. That would explain the uneasiness we've sensed from the Yeah. Family. See, we had ulterior motives coming here. We were investigating. Safety. Were this to become public, it would it would tarnish the name of the planet. That's true. Festivities. It's like a bad Google, Google review. <laughs> it's no wonder they'd want to keep it under wraps. 
So maybe that's why they. Even the guests this... No, but they gave us like sure a now. good room even before even that. Monster that she encountered, indisputable proof. Yeah, we were able to get out of there, but not everyone could. Like a normal person. Wouldn't. How could a meme that her death and murder I'm sorry, I know in a dream that the family proclaimed. I know it has a I know it has a proper meaning. I've learned about it. On Penacone, but include the family as well. Hearing meme in such a serious context. <laughs> like I'm actually gonna look it up right now. I know it has a proper meaning. And if you Google the definition of the word meme, this is actually what comes up first. Can I Google a word definition and it still work? Um, or is it going to give me some AI slop? No, actually, it gave me what, it gave me the Oxford Dictionary definition. It didn't give me AI slop. Thank you for that, actually. Oh, no, it, the first one that does come up is the haha funny. But like the, the, the meaning before meme was an element of a culture or system of behavior passed from one individual to another by imitation or other non-genetic means. So I think what calling it the something unto death boss here, the beast, it's like created from all the like, cause it says Harold's death and murder. It's created from all the like horrible nightmares and like fear, sadness, depression, the, the feelings, anxieties that people have in the everyday. And that's like, this is like a physical manifestation of it. So then co by calling it a meme, it's an imitation and it's not genetic because it's not like a, something it's like like the nature versus nurture thing it's from nature it's not something that i guess that, does that make sense is this uh, this is i'm like i'm reaching i haven't done this in a while but it makes sense that it would be a meme it's like a physical manifestation of all these like anxieties that people have day by day i think that's what it, the Swan, point is we there we understand our current predicament now Am I gonna have to do going this? To am I gonna have to do Socratic place. seminars every couple of minutes here? Is what that what we're gonna be doing in Petacony? Recollection chosen to work with the Astral Express. I don't know. Hmm. I mean, we have the Let door on the. We, they've been working with us. This is my personal request. We Not have the, the Forgotten Hall. Is it? And the answer is simple, Miss Himiko. Himiko. I simply <laughs> wish to make an exchange related to the remembrance. Is the Forgotten Hall door not Apart enough for you? my duty, I also have some personal oh. pursuit in aesthetics. Aesthetics? I what does that have to do with anything? Keeper, and You're very pretty, but... I too yearn to experience those luminous, dazzling, cherished memories. Okay. That's simple enough to understand, no? So she wants a little all, bit of adventure? Nameless to the Astral Express. And practitioners of the trail. That's a new one. Practitioners of the Trailblaze. I haven't have heard that one. In your potential, as well as in the unique splendor mm -hmm. you'll unleash on the stage. The stage? This is why. Black Swan, I what do you know? She knows you. something. <laughs> but I guess that makes sense that she would know. A place where nightmares and sweet dreams intersect. The perfect Fair. cradle. Because that's. Yeah, moments. we were in a nightmare. I understand. I guess that makes sense. Before replying, we must first discuss this among ourselves. Done. Yes. The answer's yes. Naturally, take your time. <laughs> I, I vote yes. <laughs> She's so pretty. Okay, so we need to speak with the express crew. How do you see things, Himiko? How do you see things, it's Himiko? Be skeptical of her. Fair enough. There's a significant amount of intentional misdirection. Oh, you see, I didn't even pay attention to the misdirection. I was just I'm like, she's so pretty. <laughs> If the dreamscape's anomaly really yeah. exists, and it isn't a natural occurrence, but instigated by someone behind instigated. the scenes. Then I think might it might be both. To do with the I think it might be invite. both. It's like a physical manifestation. Uh, so it is something that kind of like naturally occurred. Well, uh, excluding any extreme. But scenarios. somebody is like trying to control it. Your mind responsible for these Duke Inferno, maybe? In the dreamscape undeniably stands against the family. Which yeah, it could be Duke Inferno, but doesn't Duke Inferno die at some point? Someone is drawing in external influence. We don't see the other people though, and disrupt the which is concerning. Over Either that, or I don't even remember the, the other people. Has been forced to seek outside aid surreptitiously for and you know what? I just had a thought. In the last Star Rail video, I did say I don't think 2.3 is the end of Penacone, even though it's called Farewell Penacone. And if the other Nihility gang people don't show up in the story and then we come to the end the real end in 2.4 2.5 and it's like surprise it was the Nihility gang I don't know if that's good storytelling because 
to just have a villain pop up at the end and be like, surprise, they were the real villain all along. I don't like that. Like, I know it's done in enough stories, but I like some build up. I like I don't want the big bad to just be another villain of the week. I need the build up. Like, I think how they did it in Balabog, the Balabog arc, where, you know, Cocalia keeps kind of popping up, but she's not like a main fixture in the story. I like that. I don't like because if it is, then I but the Nailty Gang has to do something, right? Where are they? So much happens in Petaconi to the point where I didn't even remember the Nailty Gang until I saw someone bring it up on Twitter that they just didn't show up anywhere. And I'm assuming they, whoever was tweeting it, got through the story more than I did. So I, now I'm like on full alert for the Nailty Gang. Where are they? Because if they just show up at the end and it's like, haha, surprise, you've never met us, but we are the new big bad. I don't like that. I don't. Because the Stellar Red Hunters, I don't think the Stellar Red Hunters are a big bad. I think they're shades of gray, guys. Shades of gray. I don't think the Stellar Red Hunters are inherently good or inherently evil. They're just working for Elio. And I don't think Elio is inherently good or evil either. It's just all has to do with fate, right? But they kind of pop up here and there, have a bigger role in some parts than others. I like that for being like our, an antagonist. Because the Stellar Red Hunters, they are an antagonistic force, right? But an, an antagonist doesn't have to be evil, right? It's just a thing opposing the protagonist. The protagonist doesn't have to be good either. The protagonist can be a villain. It's just the main character of the story. The antagonist is the one in opposition that's creating conflict of some sort. That's usually the Stellar on Hunters. I don't know what it is here. Cause the point of like our Stellar on Hunter for this area is mainly Firefly. And that I think the point of Firefly being here and like us having a friendship with Firefly is to show that the Stellar on Hunters are not inherently evil. They're just doing their jobs. But I'm just, ah, what are we doing in Patacone? Anyways, that's my, my TED talk. I think that if the, they're going to go the route of using the Nihility Gang for something, they should have shown up in places by now, and they haven't. Um, and I don't like that. But Moral of the story. Because the 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 they, they put so much the emphasis on that trailer for them. So they have it's to be important me. somewhere, he sent out right? Encrypted, nameless message. And the mastermind behind the anomaly are on the same side. There's one thing about me I will pull, I will point out the loopholes in your story. I will do that. Well, this doesn't necessarily mean a thing, right? The fools and the Riddlers? Methods, both the fools and the Riddlers could pull it off. Who's the Riddlers? The, message too? the fools is the masked March, fools, but what are the Riddlers? Down. It's just a possibility. But okay. If this encrypted message I should go get a snack. I'm kind of hungry. Prank, but Dunzo to invite the trailblaze into the I thought Himiko said Dunzo, but there's yeah, Dunzo. <laughs> well, let me tell you what I discovered. And oh, sorry, well. It's bad news. Oh, well. Reliable sources, some people spotted a tall silver, silver armored, armored man. I've reached out to the Bloodhound family for news. You think they're going to tell you anything? Those guests who claim to have seen You think they're going to tell you anything, Welt? And this Oh, they I did tell you something. It. Dear God, okay. I send it to you. Open it and take a look. Dear God. Well, it sounds so dejected. <laughs> Wait! Why is it so dis quiet, by the way? It's, I can't get it in the recap, but tall silver armored man. It's Sam. It's Firefly. Also, I'm sorry. I'm just the tiny little brony. Or silver wolf, my bad. The tiny little silver wolf with a gun. What is I love it. I guess this is probably a good time to say uh, they finally announced a Honkai Quotations collaboration with the PC case, PC peripheral brand Height. It's a Silver Wolf collaboration. What happened to the Honkai one, guys? What happened to it? The Honkai Impact third one that was announced, the Song Tui PC case. What happened to the original plot of the movie? There's still a really good chance I'm just going to buy the Silver Wolf PC case and I want the mouse pod and keycaps too. I want the whole nine yards. Um, just because for those of you who don't know, hold on. I don't know how to show you all this. My PC cursor is Silver Wolf. I love Silver Wolf mainly for the fact that her Honkai Impact 3rd counterpart, Haxor Bunny, is one of my favorite ca characters in Honkai Impact 3rd to this day. Um, so obviously I love Silver Wolf in game now. Um, <laughs> Literally, there's Honkai Impact 3rd gameplay footage in her trailer. Come on. Um, so I actually probably am going to buy the Silver Wolf case. Um, so I'm going to have to do a... We'll, we'll do a whole video where I switch out my PC case. And I have to rebuild my PC. And probably I will break something. So um, it releases the end of the year. That is when they're going to start shipping. 
So we'll have, work, we'll have to make do with that. If I end up only getting the keycaps, it's because I, I panicked and was like, I can't just do the case. I, I don't want to have to re replace everything. So I, I, I can do one piece at a time with replacing parts in my PC, but I can't do the whole thing at once. It, that scares me. That that scares me. <laughs> Could I? Because you can also buy a pre-made iBuyPower PC with the case and all that. And I should probably do that because I it's I need to upgrade certain things anyways. But I'm personally, I refuse. And you want to know why I refuse? I don't want Windows 11. <laughs> I have it on my laptop and I hate it. I don't want Windows 11. That is the only reason I'm not buying the full PC. I could, I should get the full PC. I probably need it. I need to upgrade a lot of things in my PC and that would probably be better. I don't want Windows 11. I refuse. Anyways, that's my, that's my talk. I refuse. It's, it's that hacker girl. <laughs> hacker girl. <laughs> it's so quiet though. I'm like having to read because I can't hear. I was just talking about the Stellar Own Hunters. Plus, you're good to uncovering the truth. Yeah, because they... It's Elio's script. That's... They're like an antagonist. But they're not evil. They're creating conflict because they know what's going to happen. And they're like pushing us towards that. But they don't have ill intentions with it. Look, she's... <laughs> Honestly, I'm okay with the the break in paradise ending. I like drama. <laughs> Let's end the filler episode here. Oh, she's giving us the she's giving us the cheat codes. <laughs> Silver Wolf is giving us the cheat codes. Sam. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Fair fight. Get along. I like how they're like, Sam, don't be overwhelmed by him. It's Firefly. Oh. Are you sure that's not a message from Elio? Factions have started to move. All right, we're in it now. Thanks, Silverwolf. Hunters, that was actually kind of helpful. <laughs> it's not. Nowhere safe from them. I. The Mar. Is clear. <laughs> Welt voice. Mar. Because <laughs> it's we, we've been over this. They're just doing their jobs. The All right. What are we at? The what are we at? Every party has, Every party its, has its own motives. And they're attempting to thwart each other. Bum bum. <laughs> we still don't know what this legacy entails. It's only a matter of time before the power struggle True. snares innocent bodies. It didn't Fontaine. <laughs> it didn't Fontaine. It's reportedly a remnant of Glamoth's iron cavalry. Yeah. He engineered war. Uh -huh. He possesses superhuman perception and acts decisively. He'll leave no margin for error. This individual but he's so nice. is every bit as dangerous as Kafka. That's why I, I, cause, um, in the trailers for Firefly, you get to see her bounty or Sam's bounty. Mention is probably and hotel. For the sake of what's to come, a visit seems the sealed dreamscape hotel. So that's what was blocked off and why we went to the weird in between with all the clocks instead. Okay. What did I want to say about Sam? There was something I wanted to say about Sam. Oh, no, just that the bounty, because all the Stellar Hunters have bounties, the bounty for Sam slash Firefly is right underneath Kafka's, I believe. So it's, I think it's, this is actually kind of funny, the order. Um, and it'll be funny and ironic in a second. Kafka, Firefly slash Sam, Blade, and then Silverwolf. <laughs> and I think it's funny because Silverwolf's is the lowest. And it's like by a fair amount. I just think that's funny. But she is the hacker, obviously, so she just probably doesn't get caught as much. So, uh, what if we get found out? Should we? I think that has to do with informing the family. I don't really think it's a trap because they're not, they're, they're not, they don't have a reason to set traps unless it's for the greater plot, you know? <laughs> do it for the plot. But what if we get found out would be my biggest just concern. The Express is investigating the Stellaron hunters. Fair. I'm sure they'll understand. We'll plan but our next would they though? Because if it's like really under the wrap, under wraps. Then we are in agreement. Let's return and inform Miss Black Swan. Would it work the same? Would they be understanding, you know? I got Akron and Black Swan in the same room now? All right, let's 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 do this. <laughs> Hi, Black Miss Swan. Black Swan. <laughs> the Express is willing to cooperate with you. Oh, it's just us on screen we now. Need oh. A proper guide. 
to navigate the memories. That's in. true. We do know someone who we I need. We need to. Service. We need someone who knows that. I will not. Like, well, could probably do an okay you job your own rooms. if it is anything like drink. the Sea of Quanta. If everything goes without a hitch. We'll see but maybe this isn't the time hotel's lobby. to risk something like that, you know? In the real world to ensure everyone's well, <laughs> if needed, I will also parlay with the family. Oh. I assume there's no problem, Miss Black. You know, I would understand if this is the Welt from the Sea of Quanta, like a version of him that got stuck there. Even if I personally did rescue your I wouldn't want to go back either. <laughs> I wouldn't want to go back either. No problem, of course. Other than the fact that my feelings are a little <laughs> We're counting on you, Welt. As for All us, right. we're counting on you, God. Dreamscape's true visage. Are we gonna do this with ha half an hour into the video? I wonder if Fireflies return to reality yet. Fireflies walking around to Sam, as far mm. as I know. I don't have her contact in. Yeah, we don't have that. I'll ask Black Swan. All right. Okay. Back into the dream week. I'm starting to get a really bad headache, guys. Um, I went right past my room. I thought it was around the corner. Hi, Black Swan. We don't have a real bed in here. What if I don't want to sleep on the waterbed? What if I don't like? like, what if you accidentally fall into a dreamscape? What if I don't want to do that? This couch doesn't look that like it looks like, comfortable to sit in, but I don't know about sleeping on it. Okay, let's go in. Do we want to talk to? Let's get some you more. Worried about that girl? Yes. You can talk to it's me. It's JRPG rules. We have to interact with everything. In this world, there's no one who heals so what does Black Swan have to say? Better than a memo keeper. Oh, that concerns me a little bit. Um, we have a lot of options. Let's interact with everything. I did what Thanks I for saving do. me. You are special. Does she all. know about the so Stellaron? That many pairs of eyes are watching Probably, everything. right? If she is a memo keeper and knows everything, she probably does. So can you confirm Firefly is safe? Don't worry. That is a one-way door leading to awakened reality. Awakened reality? Unless that girl is so stubborn that she refuses to wake up I mean, from the dream, which isn't possible. She might be. She must be holed up somewhere in the hotel massaging her eyes right now. <laughs> Firefly. I would cuz that was she had her, she did the whole monologue that I cried over. Yeah. But I think she would be like she would she would have to wake up, especially if she's a stellar on hunter, right? But to be honest, I don't really tr trust memo keepers. It appears you've had some unhappy memories. Forgotten Hall, memory of chaos, this scarred. Makes the most sense <laughs> to you, me, and the, the enemy of my enemy is my friend. Sort of vibes. So you can take it easy and trust. So Black Swan and the memo keepers are of our friends course, today. Not the only memo keeper who has come. Penitone is the other one? Is there other ones? To factions beyond the family for the first time. Oh. And the girl must record this historic moment. Why was? Why now? So try Especially if something's broken. Why? As well, why not wait? As long as you can see them. Like the hotel is broken. Maybe it was last minute. But you're not returning to your room. No, I will accompany you into the dream to prevent harm from befalling you all. Memo keepers don't need a dream. Why don't? Anyway. Oh, I was like, but don't aren't you coming into the dream with us? Why are you, use your own bed? What the heck? But she doesn't need a dream pool, so she's fine. But that's all for now. All right. Drift peacefully off. To that sleep. wasn't too long. And I'll be right with you. It's like I said, JRPG rules. We must interact with everything. <laughs> they look so pretty together. <laughs> all right, enter the code. All right, cheat code time. Lie down. Let's do it. Let's do this. Into the Nazi of Quanta we go. Back in this familiar. Uh, the dog again. This way, what do you darling. want from me, darling? She called me darling. Oh, there's a bird in here too. Hold on. Not the tea table. Oh, 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 what's happening? The tea utensils on the tea set start to tremble as if they have something to say. We have to interact with everything. I forgot the rule. They say we have to get out of here. Redacted <laughs> is about to breach this place. Who's redacted? The teapot says, fool, stop spreading anxiety. Yeah, you're going to add to the something onto death, boss. We've got men and weapons. We'll manage. The teacup says, with just us. Are you crazy? Redacted. We'll tear us to shreds. The teapot says, it's nothing. This is nothing. We're desperados on the lamb, remember? <laughs> what does that even mean? Now sit down and drink this. We'll manage and we'll definitely overcome this. The calm gear. Okay. I actually just wanted to investigate the damn dog again. But a cold presence catches your attention. It is a statue of a hound. And there it goes. For a moment, you are startled as the hound's presence appears less stable. The next moment, it gets consumed by the distorted memory zone. Okay. 
Give me the bird. I tried to jump on the couch. I did. I did try to jump on the couch. Oh, the worried bird. Don't move. I'm brainstorming how to improve the design. The shape of this stove is too mundane. What stove? You mean the fireplace? It should have been decorated a little more. Hang on. Maybe this current version is pretty good. But I still feel like the first draft was better. Never mind. I still have to ask Lady Vermilion what she thinks. Who's Lady Vermilion? I guess that's why they're pink and not red. We got an alfalfa salad. That sounds really good. I'm hungry, guys. Nothing there. Just another tea table. The idle tea set is neatly arranged on the table. Conversations and sights of past still vivid in one's mind. Okay. It's floating, guys. That's not lightly. What's wrong? All right. Are you not feeling well? No, I have a headache, actually, Black Swan. Um, yeah, I don't feel so good. I know you're more sensitive <laughs> to memoria. The huh. more easily affected. Uh, that has to be a stellar on thing, correct? This is also why I have to accompany you. All right. Understandable. I should use my methods to relieve you. The, your what? Don't worry. As your companions are safe. Uh-huh. I had both of them each give me a trinket before I entered the dream. Okay, so this companions. Me to feel I was like, what about that? There was three of them. What, not both. Then I remembered, well, didn't come. They're already well, it's not with us. Rooms. Will you be comfortable in following me now? Time waits for no one. We must hurry Time to the waits lobby. for no one. Is the door clipping? Or is that just March's the design? Room is this way. Like, I should go meet up with her. It looks like you, like, put two different doors together, like, in The Sims or something, and it's, like, clipping here. Anyways. New sticker! The dreamscape room. I am getting such a bad headache. I don't know where this is coming from. I don't think it's a motion sickness headache, because that hasn't happened in a while. For, th for those of you who don't know, I get motion sickness very easily. Games, IRL, it doesn't matter. Like, I can't go on boats at all because I get seasick within, like, five minutes of being on a boat. Even if it's just, like, on a lake. I can't go on boats. Um can't read in cars i can't do any of it but every now and then i do get very motion sick from games but i've never had that issue with star rail before so i don't know where that's coming from i mean it is really hot out so maybe that's it but like i have the air on i'm drinking iced tea i don't know all right we gotta look everywhere another chest wood if i end up recording another video after this i probably will just go and grab like a advil or something i can last that long i think i say that and this watch this video go on forever your memories tell you this is March 7th. This is, this is March's room. Don't make me plural that. Unless fate intervenes, she will awaken here. So we ask if she's there and there's no response. We say, are you in there? We're about to set off. And you knock again, but there's no response. March? You knock harder and there's still no response. I know what you're thinking, huh. but alas, that oh. girl isn't in there. You let me do knock like a million times. Room. For why? So how did we get here? Then? The moment you stepped into the memory zone, oh. the building structures lost all meaning. So that's why she has the trinkets. I can sense that she is in a far away. If we all now, used the same bed, would we? Could we have time. gone if we together? To that lobby, the is that? Are you allowed to do that? We'll have to try a little harder. Okay, I'm concerned. These poor little things stumbling about. Stumbling. Strange. So. There appears to be someone else's presence here. Who's present? Who am I getting jumped by? I have seen this same layout a million. Uh, oh, it's Agron! <laughs> How was this possible? Black Swan's freaking out. Understandable after uh, the Rondo cutscene. It's Agron! No staff members here at all. How did Agron get in here? Huh? Did what she? She didn't have the cheat codes. So you you know each other? Yes. She's the memo keeper I mentioned. Okay. We'll have to cut the banter short. Let's first. Did she get lost again, though? Like, actually. <laughs> overly friendly children, shall we? Oh, I hope I have a trial team. Because. Okay, no, we don't. And I can't auto clear this. We're getting a lot of un auto clearable um, little battles here. Black Swan will assist you for the next part of our journey. All right. Search. Full enhance. Ah, uh, blast that. Can't take out all four of them. I think I should have gotten a trial Akron. Oh, it just, it locked on you. That wasn't really who I wanted to lock on, but it kind of is an AoE anyways, so not really concerned. Shield up, guys. I hope I get some skill points. We got skill points. Awesome. Take them out. I'm going to save that Dunhong ult because I don't think I need it. Blast. That one goes boom. And now that one goes boom. Nice. We saved ults too. That's always good. Finally, some peace. When we fight the the meme boss, what are the, the meme lord. 
We could ask you the same. Thing. So at least we have another another friend. It's a long story. Oh, it's it's right, it's right. What is she saying? as she should remember. What is she saying? Became friends with some of the bloodhounds and was helping oh, them yeah. track down a yeah. wanted criminal. Sam. Except I ended up here for some. Because she got lost. How'd she get lost this time? Also, I found out recently that there's a hidden ending for Penaconi that has to do with the red text. That might be. I don't think that's a spoiler because I don't know the ending, but I just know it has to do with Acheron. So we have to be very careful. This is why I'm like JRPG rules are now coming into play. Apparently, if you interact with everything, you can get that like not interact with everything. But like if you go through all the text options, you get that ending. I, that That's what I've heard, something related to that. So JRPG rules are now in effect. We must interact with everything. They've been in effect since the last video, but th this is also kind of why. You aren't we got to do everything. I want the good ending. Hiding. I don't know if it's good or bad. I I'd be capable of that in front of a memo keeper. Fair. How about in front of me? <laughs> I can. I'm built different. I'm gonna lie into next Tuesday. What about me, Acheron? That's not what I meant. <laughs> it's just a figure of speech. I thought she was gonna turn me down so hard. This dreamscape is fraught with danger. Yeah, this is the cheat code dreamscape. Is the same. That's How what we're calling we it. Forces? Okay. I can. I like that. From harm. But in the memory zone, I'll need assistance from That's the memory keeper as well. That's a five heads are better than four, if we right? Run into the family, it it'll be even better if Welt was here. Explain the situation. Hmm. What do you think? Of course. Yeah. Never hurts to have more people. Thank you. That's literally Thanks what I said. I trust Acheron as well, but I. With you again, Miss Black Swan. Again? Hmm. What do you I mean again? I hope so. What is that supposed to mean? What do you mean again? Okay, fine. Cool. Great. Oh, the bubble fountain. That's not what I wanted. I wanted the sticker. But the dream bubble blubbering from the fountain whispers to you. Truth and existence are false propositions. Hurry up and jump in. Become one with us in this dream. That's terrifying. That is terrifying. Lost. Oh, because Akron got lost. Okay. All right. Let's do a quick look around. Nothing here. JRPG rules. JRPG rules. Will that extend the runtime of all these videos? Yes. But I want the good ending. I want the secret ending. I don't think the tables are going to do it. So chest. I don't even know how you would get those chests if you don't unlock them as you go. Like like if it's like it's like a domain. Check over here. It might tell me I can't go. Oh, oh that's where we came from. Never mind. Okay. So we looked at We looked at everything down there. Okay. Uh, let's do the quack puzzle. We'll do the puzzle. The insecure dream ticker says I'm so stupid, so dumb and so ugly. I'll never play a good clocky. <laughs> don't say that. You're being too harsh on yourself. You're perfect. Don't say that. There we go. I think these puzzles are so fun because you think they're supposed to like perfectly connect, but no, that's not how it works. It's kind of, you really are just cheesing it. The whole point of these puzzles is to cheese it. We can awaken the puzzle. It says, I think I'm not that bad myself. Who knows? I might be able to do this job well. Oh, good for you. How cute. All right, let's find the lobby. Okay, there we go. There's the doors. I have to sneeze. <coughs> Okay, we're good. Ugh, dreamscape reverie. Oh, I guess that this is just part of the dreamscape. Kind of creepy in here? Does it stay creepy forever if you don't do it properly? Oh, this okay. Room. Why is it upside down? <laughs> She's so mad. <laughs> don't worry, we'll figure it. We just we have to flip around ourselves. It's fine. The memory zone is constant. That's what the bubble fountain is for. It looks like we'll have to think of a way. To walk on the ceiling. We're walking on the ceiling. Okay, We're this is easy. On the ceiling right now. Fair. Zacharon's words speak sense. Fair. Regardless, we have to reach that <laughs> flat surface. That hanging surface overhead. hanging overhead. And we're not scaling the pillar, of course. I, I would like to scale the pillar. Teach everyone some traversal tricks. We already we learned about the bubble stuff, though. We know this, right? We know about the bubble stuff. All right, we, we're full on skill points. I was like, can I, do I have, do I need trick snacks? We're good. Bubble charge. Can you feel the memorial? I thought I didn't read that right. I thought it said Flavoria. Next, find <laughs> I was like, what? Spot and try There's one over the here. Wall. What is that? Also, why am I back down to two? Cool. Bubbles. What's up with that? Okay. I just want to do this one over here. Oh, bop. Oh, I can't get that one. Oh, but you can't like change the angle you're at. <laughs> I guess he probably had to do that through the ceiling then. Oh, that's what that little portal is for, probably. Okay. So we do have to do this first. Okay. We got this. There we go. Bump. Oh, got you. You probably could avoid that entirely, but I mean, if I have Akron, 
that's the reason I have Akron active so I can just really quickly clear the bosses because we're interacting with everything, you know? It worked. You really can walk up. I'm going to hide behind this pillar. A memory zone of this level is near child's And play I want to see one that's not child's play. I want to see on. a difficult one Let's actually. Head out through the front door. Okay, I just want to refill my trick snack. Not a full refill, just a quick little little one. Dream four. To take out these guys. Um there's a chest here that's just floating. Okay, all right, never mind. Okay. No interactions. Okie dokie. I can't reach that from here. Okay, I do want to get up there though. So I need more bubble stuff. So we're gonna have to go in here, replenish, and then let's go back. We're gonna go here. And now we're walking on the ceiling. I think everyone's good. Cause I'm like, this might be, yeah, this might be uh, an actual boss fight. Um, but I can auto clear this one through, so we're good. I think I'm gonna let this chill here for a second and I'm gonna go grab the, my bottle of Advil. <laughs> Let's take ibuprofen together. I've returned. I got the not ibuprofen. <laughs> okay, perfect timing. Everyone's still alive. Monkeys, uh, giving me room for my money though. Oh, monkey's almost dead. When did that happen? Nice, that was better than last time. That was much better than last time. We're good. Awesome, I used that to my advantage. Watchmaker's telescoping lens? Break effect set. Oh, maybe I want to switch my set that I have on uh, Firefly. Cause that'll probably work better. It's probably recommended actually. Maybe I'll do a two piece and a two piece. What does the other, the four piece look like on that? Fleeting happiness? <laughs> Why does it look like that? In this mask? Wild balaclava? That's really cool. Artifacts or relic. They're not artifacts, they're relics. I just want to see what the whole four piece benefit on that set is you master of dream machinations set when the wearer uses their ultimate on an ally all allies break effect increases by 30 percent for two turns yeah i think we don't need the four piece is probably an unnecessary probably do a two piece fire damage boost that i already have and have built up and then i can just switch out these two i don't necessarily like these substats here though and i don't have another piece from this set that i could like run with both you know yeah that's the only piece i have from the set so i can't do a two piece yet so i'm gonna leave it i'll leave it but I do think I want to do that on my Firefly. If you couldn't tell, I'm currently in the process of building up my Firefly to actually be a main DPS on my account because I love her so much. Um, I did the same thing with Dunhung. He doesn't let me down. All right, now we can continue. Bubble charge is back. When do I go up to three bubble charges? Because that was really nice to have three. I would like the three back, quite frankly. Give me this bird. Yank it out. What does it want? This is the lost bird. <laughs> oh no, wait, it's auto clearing. The lost bird. Just like Acheron. How can we get out of here? The roads here are on the wall one moment and over my head the next. So confusing. Okay, um, I'm going to faint. <laughs> Don't you know how to fly? Oh yeah, I was so dizzy that I forgot about that. I'll have to fly back to the tree. Got to get Lady Vermilion to redesign this route. Bye bird. We got a float disc burger. We got the burger. Okay. This is got you. A dead end. No, it's not, Acheron. You gotta have imagination. <laughs> You're natural, aren't you? You're a prodigy Just... at remembrance. Oh. I need to do this first. Prodigy at remembrance. I do wonder how it'll come back later. Like, I can't wait until we get the actual... We don't have the path of remembrance, right? What are our paths? Destruction, preservation, harmony. Once we get remembrance, that's going to go crazy. There we go. Also, I'm just real. I'm realizing something. Hold on. I kept making mentions to the Sea of Quanta, right? And I was going to say... Obviously, we started with Fizz because we got the baseball bat and we just kind of just started. We didn't really have any like magical powers or anything. So that, that makes sense. We got the preservation path with fire during Bellabog, which was all snowy. So we got the opposite of that to combat that. With Harmony path, we get the imaginary. We get imaginary damage. And if that's if it's going the same route, if that's the opposite of like this area's main thing, Quanta, Quantum, Sea of Quanta, that would make sense. So imaginary combats that, but it also could be we got imaginary because it's like, ooh, imagination, the dreamscape. I think it might, might have more to do with being the opposite of quantum, though. I'm that's at least my theory. That's what I'm gonna rock with. I choose to stand by that because no, I don't think it's exactly the Sea of Quanta, but I think it's the Honkai Star Rail equivalent of it with a different name. Like, look at all of the cubes. That's in the Sea of Quanta. That makes sense. So I'm, I'm gonna stand by that theory. We've arrived. There's an elevator Sticker. here, just like in the lobby. Collect. We should be able to reach our destination. We got the lost part three. But 
the memory zone up ahead there's appears so to many. be severely there's twisted. so many things be careful oh my god wait which one do we want to do uh, let's go down this way first okay okay i wasn't prepared for that it's level 92. why do i hear it moving in there okay let's go all right okay take it over this one's gonna be rough it's level 92. it's just gonna be the rough one I don't look forward to this. We're not doing that bad. We're just gonna be here for a while. Like I could go on my phone. I could go, I literally could walk away again. I might go grab, I'm gonna go grab my bag of chips. I'm, I have sweet potato chips in my cupboard. I'm gonna go grab them. Watch when I get back here, it's gonna be dead. I'm back. You better, oh my God, it's dead. I grabbed my bag of chips so I could like snack while I'm doing these longer battles. So I'll also kind of like save my voice a little bit because I'm hungry and I have to stop eating at 3 a.m. because of the medicine I take in the morning. I need to take it on an empty stomach. So timing wise, I kind of have to stop eating at 3, 3 a.m. And I'm, I'm in a mood where I'm, lo I'm locked in. I don't know how long I'm going to be playing the Star Rail tonight, but I'm going to keep going. Wait, I have another piece for the set. Uh, the substats are bad, but I mean, I'll take it for now. Wait, so I can change Firefly's relics right now. Can we sort by set? No, no. I wish we could sort it by set. Oh, but it's up here. Okay, so switch you out and then the switch you out. So we have a break effect. What was the other buff on the set I have on her? Skill damage by 12% under after unleashing ult. Okay, I like this. This two piece, two piece. Okay, this is good. Not gonna level them up right now. I just wanted to do that before I forgot it. Okay, that's good. Any interaction, investigate. People say books are the physical medium of memories, but in the hotel filled with dream bubbles, this wall of books looks punny in comparison. Okay. Oh, yank. Oh, yank. Come on. Yank. Yank. Yank the bird. Oh, that one worked. Okay, cool. The playful bird says rats. I can't believe I'm caught by you. That doesn't count. One more time. Please don't. Hold on. I've got to go back to the great tree. I'll beat you next time. Bye. Bye, bird. It's like the normal hotel, but it has all these cube formations. That's a sea of quanta hotel. Investigate. Don't forget to put them back in the right spots when you're done. When you touch a book, its spine suddenly blurts out a reminder, causing you to pull your hand back in shock. <laughs> Fair enough. They are not our books. Investigate. Oh, it's the same. Don't forget to put it back when you're done. Okay. Investigate. The people say the books are the physical medium. Okay. I don't think they thought somebody would um interact with every point in the room that says you can investigate here um but i am that somebody i want the go i want the akron ending all right let's go this way i want this chest oh cavern of corrosion here oh, okay cool what uh which one is this path of dream dive oh it's the watchmaker artifact relic not artifacts relic set okay also pioneer diver of dead waters i think i actually that's what i need for akron so that's actually really good because that was the thing akron doesn't have the proper relics on her right now because i don't have i didn't have that domain unlocked and i think i just unlocked it okay so we went down both of those ways so now we can Arrived. go the way we're supposed to an elevator here just like in the this lobby. is gonna be a long video today Should guys able to reach our destination what calyx is this I'm but letting everyone finish. Up ahead appears to be severely twisted. That's not good. Be careful, everyone. Actually, I think we might end the video here and I'll we'll just pick up in the next one because this is probably like a natural lull because it's about it's gonna get weird in the next one. Golden butt of Oh, this is the money. Oh, this is the credit calyx for Petaconi. Okay. Really funny that you put the uh money calyx in the twisted dreamscape of the hotel. You know what that stands for? That stands for capitalism. I don't think it actually does, but I'm, I'm going to say it does. But that's going to be it for today. We will just like, I usually don't like to end in the middle of like a domain. And that's kind of what this is. Um, but we are going to do that today. Pull check. We can do some polls. We will do some polls for, on Run May's banner. For those of you who don't know, I really want to pull for Jiao Chiu in the next patch. But I don't have Run May. She's one of the best supports in the game to this day. And I also don't have Gallagher and both Run May and Gallagher are really good characters to run with Firefly. And like I said, I'm building up my Firefly to run as a main DPS for like a hyper carry, hyper break team. So I really want both of them. Still don't have Gallagher. Don't know if and when we'll ever get a four star selector event and if I'll even be able to do it because I'm so behind in the game. I have so many things to finish, but we're working on that right now. So I've decided I'm pulling on Run May's banner for the next 10 days, even though I should probably be saving for Jiao Chiu, but let her rip. I also should make it known that I have won every single 50-50 since last year that I've done. And um, I'm still running on that. So we're really pushing it. We are really pushing it. 
I've run every I've won every single 50-50 I've come across on my account since Silverwolf's last rerun in December of 2023. I've won every 50-50. So yeah, <laughs> that's it for this video. If you like this video, make sure to give me a like down below as well as subscribe for more and click the little notification bell to be notified when I upload new ones. As always, I hope everyone had or is having a super lovely day wherever you are in the world. I'm going to record more Star World directly after this. Yeah, and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye, guys.